It is something very special indeed to make it to a UEFA Champions League final. Now these two teams are intent upon tasting glory. Welcome to the showpiece event on the European club calendar. Derek Ray here in the commentary position, joined tonight for live coverage by Stuart Robson. It's Real Madrid against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? And they're underway now in the Champions League final. We're about to find out which team is the best in Europe. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Carvajal starts with Ferdinand Mendy in the fullback positions. Toni Kroos starts with Luka Modric in central midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. Marco Asensio's in the thick of things. Well, in fact, a good but straightforward claim by the keeper. And the PSG team looks like this. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Marquinhos plays alongside Lucas Hernandez in central defence. Marco Verratti starts alongside Vitor Ferreira in central midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Kylian Mbappe. Real Madrid unable to hang on to the ball. Now what can Paris Saint-Germain do from this position? Magnificent defending! Mbappe and the advantage is with PSG and with that the attack fizzles out a chopping challenge and the referee has got to have a big think about it well a yellow card so early in this one Stuart well it doesn't matter how early it is in the game that's a poor challenge and deserved the booking Well, I think it's fair to say Ancelotti doesn't agree with that decision. A routine save. Could be doing a fine job of protecting the ball. Attacking possibilities for PSG. Asensio. Really high-class goalkeeping from Courtois. sign of danger Modric unable to hang on to the ball when you're on a yellow card you've really got to tread oh so carefully and it is the case that two yellows equal a red well that was always going to happen he just couldn't contain himself could he Might see the wide route as a fruitful one, PSG. Mbappe in the centre. Well blocked, but he must clear it away. Tony Kors. And he read it well. Kylian Mbappe. Mbappe. I think most defenders would expect to be booked halting an attack in that fashion. Well, it is a caution, and stay calm might be the instructions that should come from the manager. Yeah, you're absolutely right. If they're not careful, they're going to lose another player fairly soon. Well, Ancelotti can't believe that decision. He's not happy at all, is he? Couldn't get it past that human barrier.
Fired in by Neymar. Well, it still could be dangerous. Really high-class goalkeeping from Courtois. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. And a chance for them again to play it over from the corner flag. The delivery from Neymar. Not really the ideal clearance. Oh, what an opportunity. And it has arrived. The opening statement in this UEFA Champions League final. Mbappe. Good use of advantage in favour of PSG. And a chance to whip it in here. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, they've given him too much space. He quartered the attack illegally. Now perhaps a card is forthcoming. Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. And the keeper grabbing hold of that free kick. Good piece of ball winning. Now they might be onto something. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. And short it is. Well, there's the pullback. Really sound defending. Oh, fine stop. PSG looking dangerous. A no disappointing end to the move. Jude Bellingham. Mbappe with it. Oh, great attacking play. Sliding in and winning the ball. Asensio in with a chance well it might still work out for them well no way through in the end well not long to go now till we hear the half time whistle and Real Madrid still trailing Stuarts what have you made of their first half well it's been a fairly even first half so far but they haven't shown enough creativity particularly in midfield but there's been too many Neymar Two nil now, and back on the way. And if you've already received a yellow card, you surely want to stay away from that sort of challenge. And it is a second bookable offence. That's the end of the story for him. And it doesn't surprise me, Derek. He's played on the edge today. Well, you have to conclude, Stuart, an opportunity wasted. Yeah, and the other players are furious with it, and rightly so. That's such a poor free kick. And that's an important intervention. Room to roam for PSG on the wing. Shown inside. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. And the advantage is with PSG. Well, the advantage didn't really accrue to them, and so it's going to be a free kick. Nicely saved. Mbappe and the keeper nowhere to be found. Not that he's complaining.
Well, the ball is rolling once more. PSG dominant, and it's starting to get out of hand, you just feel. And the referee's whistle. We've reached the halfway point here at Wembley Stadium. Away once again and still reflecting on a sumptuous first half performance from Paris Saint Germain. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. And quick thinking defensively. Mbappé and a simple clearance a good one and Neymar it's going to be Neymar Neymar and the referee doesn't hesitate that is a spot kick Well, that is what they didn't need to lose a player in this fashion. Well, what can you say about that? What was going through his mind? Well, it's not the referee Ancelotti should be angry with. It's the lack of discipline his players are showing at the moment. Is it going to be 4-0? The keeper going in the right direction and saving it. Well, those stats tell the story. PSG have been really good today. Their attacking play at times has been a joy to watch. Marco Asensio. Good use of advantage in favour of PSG. Oh, genuine chance. And a fine stop. Mendy. Is with Vinicius Junior. A spot on with that challenge. Mbappé. Superbly read and executed. So a throw in for PSG. And the referee now going back to deal with the earlier incident. A yellow card it's going to be. And having already received a yellow card, he's walking a very fine line. And it is the case that two yellows equal a red. Well, that was always going to happen. He just couldn't contain himself, could he? Well, I have to say, it's a red card all day long. Ancelotti's got to get his team to be more disciplined here. Crossed accurately towards the far post. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. They take it short. Plays it back. And Marco Asensio full marks to the keeper well what a reaction from the goalkeeper such a good save in the end well I'm sure he would love to have that opportunity back PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front Kylian Mbappe strong but fair tackle Mbappe Neymar now with Asensio well could be in hot water here booked already and it has been deemed a second bookable offence his day is done Stuart and if I was the coach I'd have taken him off earlier this always looked likely to happen full time Parisian pride shines through PSG have cleared the final